SIRNA, or small interfering RNA, is a type of nucleic acid that helps to reduce the amount of a certain type of protein within the body. And you can think of it like mRNA provides instructions to help build proteins, whereas siRNA is the eraser that helps to reduce the amount of a certain type of protein. Now this type of technology can be used for a variety of different conditions. And the way that it works is that siRNA can be engineered to be double-stranded. So now it has a higher amount of stability. Additionally, it's quite small, only about 20 to 30 base pairs long and it's complementary to that specific type of mRNA that's produced within the body. So you can almost think of it like a magnet. The mRNA is produced within our body to help make a protein. However, too much of that protein is being made. So the siRNA comes in and it binds specifically to that mRNA of interest. Now, once it's bound within the cell, this will actually induce the cell to destroy that mRNA so no more of that protein can actually be produced. Now, when siRNA actually enters the cell, it comes in as this double strand, and then it will be cut by a specific protein called dicer. Now, once inside the cell, and dicer has cut this into two single strands, that's what allows the siRNA to bind to the mRNA, reducing the amount of protein that's produced. Now, this is not a type of technology that is permanent. It only allows for this transient type of protein reduction. So if this is used as a type of therapeutic, it's a constant type of dosage that would be needed to reduce protein levels over time.